So today marks quite a uh, momentous occasion. Uh, for the past two years, I have been growing my hair. In December 2016, just before a friend's wedding, I had the final chop that I'd, uh, I've had for the past two years. Basically, I decided that as my hair was getting thinner and thinner, I thought I've got one last shot, that's two, one last shot at growing my hair before I basically lose it. It's, it runs in the family, my dad's bald, most of my uncles have like lost their hair. So I kind of thought it's inevitable, I'm going to lose my hair. So I decided to grow it uh, in one last ditch attempt to do so. So yeah, for the past two years, I haven't actually cut my hair once. I had a little tidy up before the wedding. And basically for the past like few months, every time I wash my hair, every couple of days, I brush my hair and so much hair comes out. I mean like, I just kept thinking to myself, I'm gonna have no hair left at this rate. So for the last few months, I've basically sort of said that I'm just gonna grow it until it's a length that's suitable enough that allows me to donate it to the Little Princess Trust. I think at one stage the requirements was like a minimum of 17 centimetres and now the website says minimum of 30 centimetres and I, I got the tape measure out last night and the bits along the top which were always a bit longer they're about 35 centimetres and the sides and back are 30 centimetres apparently when they make the wigs they, they can lose about 10 centimetres of hair apparently when they're knotting it and doing all the amazing stuff that we do so today Oh, I'm chopping off my hair. I'm off around to a friend's Antonia's house and she is going to help me cut it off in ponytails as close to the scalp as possible. Not too close, obviously, but close enough. That allows me to send it off and hopefully it can be used uh, for a wig for a child that's lost the hair. Um, yeah, really great work that the Little Princess Trust do. So I'm more than thrilled to be do uh, donating my hair. Really proud about that. As much as I'm going to miss my man bun. I'm quite looking forward to this new chapter. Short shaved head. I've never had a shaved head before. And I'm just looking forward to the ease. That's the main thing I reckon. Ease. But yeah. So the next shots will be this. This. <sighs> will be this. This mangled, long, two years worth of growth hair <laughs> being chopped off. You can tell that the only reason I grew my hair was to have it in a bun because it just doesn't look right down, it's too thin. But yeah, so this is getting chopped off in half an hour's time. Big reveal. <laughs> Ready? Jeez, I shine it. It looks alright. It looks alright. No, I like it. I think this light doesn't help, right? You can see so much scalp. <laughs> this light is making. I can basically see all of my head. Look how thin it is. Look at all that scalp. Because I'm a skull. <laughs> it looks like that light is not helping the situation at all. <laughs> I like it. I do. I like it. I think it looks good. It does look good through the beard. Yeah. Tom Hardy. Thumbs up. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Thumbs up. Cheers, I'm sorry. Uh. Alright. <laughs> Bye, hair. There it is. All my hair. Once was on my head. <laughs> right, the next person that's obviously going to see my uh, my hair is Emma, so I'm going to go in and show Emma now. <laughs> what are you done? 
<laughs> what do you want have I done? That's not the right reaction. I think it looks alright. Oh my god. You don't like it? <laughs> Why is it so short? That's, that's not the reaction I was hoping for. <laughs> you look really weird. You're just not used to it. It'll take some getting used to it. I quite like it. <laughs> what do you think, Albie? Albie? <laughs> Albie? Albie? Wakey, wakey. Don't wake him up. So Emma's not a fan. She'll get used to it. Anyway, thanks for watching. Um, I urge any of the guys out there who've got man buns that are thinking about chopping them off, Grow it long enough and then donate it to the Little Princess Trust. I still can't believe it. it's going to take some getting used to, isn't it? Ugh. Look how thin it is. I didn't realise it was getting so thin. I knew it was thin, I didn't realise it was that thin. But yeah, anyway, thanks for watching. Peace!